Hey guys, it's Mr. Bud again, and I'm here on the side of my mountain, and I've just found one of the big, one of the plants that I brought you up here to see, and this is wild violet. Now this comes in many colors. These are the the blue violets. Now I don't know how well it's going to turn up on the camera. They're actually more purple than they are than they are blue. These leaves are really rich in vitamin C, and they're a great addition to salads. And they're so safe that you can actually just eat them right off the ground. They're pretty good too. What you want to watch out for is this other plant right here. And that is Larkspur. Larkspur is a deadly, dangerous, poisonous look-alike for the blue violet. And that is dangerous. This is food. That is poison. Now right here next to this wild geranium right here is another larkspur. You can get a better shot of it, I hope. But see how close they look alike? Look here. This is where it gets the name larkspur. This looks like a spur off of a bird. Some people call this monk's hood. This birdfoot larkspur. And we'll try to get you two of the bloom right close together so you can see the differences and the similarities. Almost a mirror image, image of each other. But the leaf is different. Now there's a bird's foot violet that looks close to this. But look at the look at the bloom. Now on the violet, there's no long pointy witch's hat. See, that looks like a witch's hat or a wizard's hat. And. There's five petals here, five petals here, but look at the configuration, it's almost identical. This is good, that's bad. The leaf on the blue violet is harp shaped in comparison to the larkspur. You can see the vein pattern on the leaf. And that's how you tell the difference between edible blue violet and poisonous larkspur.